I'm Richard Lewis reporting for cadred.org. I'm here with the most disappointed team at the event, the German team, MTW. I'm here with Hoods G and Nucky. I'll start with you because we don't normally talk to you a lot. We, we say terrible things about you on the website and you ignore us probably for uh, good reason. But um, are you especially disappointed with how this has worked out or do you think it's fair given the lack of preparation and having to switch a player? Uh, it was not about Oli, like the switch it wouldn't have met every player with Tony or Oli. We, we have our internal problems, we lost the, really the key rounds, like we should have won like the Online Kingdom game of course, it was just stupid play whereas the T-side Seacross game we lost 3-4 Eekers, should have won that as well, then the draw against uh, Dynamic was winnable as well. We were out already so uh, if, if it would have been different like we would have still been in the tournament, maybe we, we were more focused and then we would have won that as well. The preparation wasn't the best but still like every game of these were like winnable except for the first game where we just got smashed and played really shit but the other games were just like stupid mistakes by us and like yeah that's all it and then you yeah you just go out if you do the mistakes as captain what do you think has been going wrong in the team because whenever we do talk about mtw we never seem to be talking about you know it's, it's always you're almost were successful it was almost there and something's gone wrong uh, well, what do you think is causing that I don't know, I think maybe it's something in the brain that, that you always win the, uh, or lose this, this, this clutch round of the important rounds. And it's all about the key rounds. I and mean, if you look at 1.6 or any other game, it's always these key rounds that, that decide if you win or lose. And yeah, I don't know why it's happening to us. Maybe it's really lack of preparation that we were not that good in communication with the English German side. Like maybe it's that as well. Or we were not that confident. Like it's some pressure, maybe. I don't know. And then you, yeah, like I said. And if you start going into this, like losing the first eco, then you're just down and then you lose another eco and it's just getting worse and worse. So George, uh, you're disappointed. Well, yeah, you are here. Yeah, hello. hello. How's it going? Um, uh, well, you seem to be trying to motivate the, the team. You shouted yourself hoarse. I mean, do you, are you happy with how it went? I mean, or how are you feeling? You look a bit down. Uh, it's always the same story at the moment. Uh, yeah, I'm dev devastated really because all year I've said I wanted to come to ESWC. It's been a dream of mine, like quite literally a dream. And uh, I came here and I said I didn't want to fail and, and we failed. And it's just uh, yeah, just, just things in the team, uh, internal issues and uh, that aren't going so smoothly in game. Like, and I, I'm calling and I'm not a caller. And, you know, I'm. I can't. No one's to blame, but uh, the di the dynamic yeah. is um, just uh, just not there at the moment. I, I honestly don't know. Do we go back to the drawing board and, and try and work it out with this same five, or you know, our changes incoming? I mean, I, I hate to ask the question, but I guess I kind of have to. I mean, are you guys gonna? stick together and make this work uh, well for me personally um uh, i'm gonna go back and evaluate my own performance and then then see if i i'm gonna obviously continue counter strike source and um, whether i can still be up there with all these guys and and then after i've evaluated myself as a caller i'll evaluate the team and uh yeah just go from there really i mean i i don't know what will happen is the future and that's just being brutally honest because yeah I don't know, like, as far as I know at the moment, that Oli will quit after the season, after the best season, um, because he just have, doesn't have enough time and stuff. And so, yeah, we will see. If maybe some things change, like he will stay and we stick with the team, maybe not, I don't know, I really don't know. Well, I'm sorry it's such a quick interview, but we are going to get thrown out of the press area. They're closing it down as we speak. So I just want to say to all you guys, uh, you know, don't be too harsh on MTW on the forums, guys. We kick them all the time. Can we just, can we all be brothers? Can we just show them some love for once, please? And while you're doing that, Stay tuned for ESWC 2011 coverage coming at you at cadred.org.